So today we're trying out Sab Rosa. It's a new restaurant we haven't been here before, but it's attached to a Kuri, which we've shown you before, which we really, really love. And actually, it's the same owner for both restaurants. Sab Rosa is just right above a Kuri. So we're excited today to finally try out a new restaurant, get some new food and everything. It's a very stark difference. You'll see in a couple of minutes when we show you. But down below is like Bollywood traditional style. Up here is more modern. It's like a New York, uh, Brooklyn type of apartment. It's really, really nice. We'll show you. So we talked to the owner last week or the week before and he was like, yeah, I own the place up there. And we had like a nice hour long conversation with him and his father down in Akuri, which was really, really cool. And then he gave us kind of a tour of this place and we really enjoyed it. And so I've been like pushing, oh, yeah, here. poking Pooja like every day. I'm like, let's go there. Let's go there. So, so bro. So even, I mean, like their even their menu looks like a magazine. magazine. I think it's a really cool concept. And they're like the whole cafe is like based on like a New York Brooklyn type of apartment is what he was telling us when he was doing it and you can see by like the interior like the wooden interior and then like the brick work in the back like behind the bar and everything it's really really nice I I think I like this one more than Akuri, Akuri just oh because it's like God. it's more modern it's like a really cool Offense. really cool Offense. and it's a nice place to work I think Sub Rosa is nice in its own way but I like Akuri on my deck. I don't know who this guy is, but like he came on top of our water, which is really cool. cool. Very small details, which is really nice. I like it. I like it. Upstairs, they have a big open area for like events and stuff like Parties, that. Parties, so. events you can rent out. And also another great playing thing is like this is not just traditional food. Down below in Akuri, I don't even know what half the stuff is because it's all like Indian dishes. They're really, really good. Super tasty, but I just don't know what to order. Here, it's like um continental burger food. pizzas I and mean, they have indian dishes as well pasta sandwiches they don't have much but what they have a huge magazine menu here yeah i went through all of it already and you didn't find anything you wanted uh, they I, have beer up here too i want that's what hibiscus want. berry what is that, a drink yeah you didn't even look at food we're downstairs and we're like i'm so hungry so hungry let's go get food and we get up here now i want a drink mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think I want, uh, their food looks pretty good. So nice, very artistic. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know, what are you in the mood for? Let's Pizza. see. You said you wanted burger, no? Yeah, but then I saw pesto sandwich as well, which looked good. Oh. Give us Sorry. two seconds, we're gonna figure out. Wow, so many more options, I don't know what to get. I used to love pizza a lot when I was a kid and whenever I used to go, I used to only order pizza. But now I think I'm a burger girl. <laughs> We've been eating pizza from Zomato like every day. She's That's ordering cheap us a, and We can so get a burger. Good. These burgers look pretty good. Smoked lamb burger. Uh, the Juicy. pizza we eat is from yeah. Romino's and they're like thick crust. Not yes, thick, yeah. but thick crust. I don't know how to explain it. But they're pretty good and cheap. That's why we eat. Uh, but when I'm out, I think I crave burgers or sandwiches because in my whole life, I've never actually craved a burger or a sandwich. And it's weird that I, now all I want to do is just eat burgers. You want this smoked lamb burger? I saw that, but I was like, would you even like a mutton yeah, why not? burger? We're going to get the smoked lamb burger to start off with. You ready for your drinks? Yes. All right, we'll order. All right. Can I turn this off? No, just keep it going. There it goes. Come, please. And, okay. Bum, ba, da, da. Yes, sir. May we have the smoked lamb burger? Okay. And... Oh, yeah, egg, hibiscus berry. Okay. Thank you, Baya. Thank you, thank you. So you can order from a puri down. Wow. The, the owner where, also where said where? that if someone asked for a menu from Sub Rosa, they would give it. I think I'm just gonna get a peach iced tea. Peach iced I figured something else out. We know. <laughs> just get the menu. Actually, um, what iced tea flavors do you have? Uh, lemon, peach. Just two? Two? Just two, but yeah, lemon or peach. Tea Arco. Do you have another flavor? Arco, maybe it's just a bit, you know? Ah. Uh, when it was asked, lemon or peach or what flavor is it? Oh, okay. 
Can I have a peach iced tea then? Okay. Sorry that I made you get that. <laughs> Thank you so much. One peach iced tea, one hibiscus berry, one scoop lemon. Ah, yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. You need to learn. He he needs to learn Hindi. Not a lot of people speak English here, and he kind of struggles. And then he speaks Nepali in the hopes that they just magically understand. Some of the words transfer over, and they, it works. Saying. It works. It works. Another thing, been super impressed by this place is like the staff here are very very friendly and very They're very helpful. Very nice, very friendly, very <clears throat> polite, and whenever they see us in the cafe or the restaurant they come they you know say come and hello. say hi how are you they how take you after the doing? owner who is very very friendly his father was very friendly we sat like i said we sat with them for like probably two, two hours. hours two hours and he's telling a story about how he met it the dalai it. lama and all this really cool stuff so we got to experience the whole dalai lama thing with them it was really nice mm -hmm. they were really nice too so yeah but now we're just waiting for our food because i'm hungry so what to say see you later gators our drinks ready. came. Tell us, Pooja, how is it? I took my first sip. Take another sip. We want to see you sip it. I'm going to look like... Uh... You look like Donald Trump. Two hands on a, on a glass. She already spilled some. That's why she's being extra careful. And, 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 and. Mm -hmm. Fabulous. What is it? Just like me. Fabulous. No. <laughs> so it's hibiscus berry. I don't even know what it's that is. It's a mocktail and it has hibiscus tea, cranberry juice, mint leaves. Ice. Don't forget the ice. Ice. Of course, <laughs> the most important. And it's, it also has watermelon chunks Ooh. and sweet and sour mix. Oh. And, it's, and you can taste all those. It's just missing the vodka. Yeah. No, I think I like gin more. So Pooja is fancy. I went with the uh, iced tea. I'm a basic, basic, basic girl. Super, super sweet. But at least it tastes like peach. A lot of places just taste like water. Wow, this is yummy. All right, trade these. Try. Pooja doesn't want to share. This is a big glass. Yours is much more earthy. You can taste the mint at the end. It's not that sweet though, yours is not. Mine is very, 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 very sweet. Look at Pooja's face. No? Not not the winner? You didn't like the peach tea? No. You like yours? I think it's the winner. Even you know that. Yours is much more mellow, like I said. Earthy. It's a it's mellow person. Just, Pooja's not. I have to turn the camera. Pooja's not a mellow person. But By I am a mellow far. Person. She's quick to heat up, quick to cool down. And sometimes you see her head smoking. <laughs> And coming out of her ear, she'll, you'll see steam and stuff. That's how quick she heats up. Just overheats immediately. Even little tiny thing. Even yesterday, we were playing Ludo. We were playing this game on the phone while we waited for something. And she's like, you know what? I realized that I need to calm down a little bit. And because she would always get super mad at the game, at the phone. She would say, it's cheating. There, It's stupid and cuss so much and saying it's the worst game ever as she played. Because, like, I typically win, and so she would Not get, all like... all the time. I rarely win at that game, actually. She usually wins. But the times that I would win, she would be like, they're cheating, da 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 So she's like, I need to learn how to calm down when we're playing games. It's just a game. It's not a life game. <laughs> so, yeah, she's uh, not a mellow person. Now, the food we wait. There's the burger. Pooja's already, look, already super excited. Doesn't wait for me, nothing. The burger looks good. Generous. The gener the size of the burger looks good, looks heavy. I will say I'm a little disappointed about the fries. I'm a fry guy, I wanted a bunch of <laughs> bunch of fries, but it's all right. And it looks super tasty, the cheese. Let's get in there close up with the burger. Mm. The cheese, the minced meat. How much was this, do you know? 350. 350 for this. So pretty good price and, 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 and take a taste. Coleslaw I feel first. shy to. I love coleslaw. You feel shy to love coleslaw. We all no, feel, I feel very shy, shy to, to <laughs> eat a burger in video because it's a messy. Come food. on, be a monster. Do you want me to do it then? Mm, I can hold. Okay, oh, you so good. you hold it. She has to finish eating her fry. Doesn't even care. Sorry, technical use. difficulties, guys. Please do not mind is me this, chewing. Is this spicy? Yeah, but it's it's Did good. It make me hiccup spicy. No. 
I kind of hate when Hayden uh, eats two fries together instead of just eating one. This is a little spicy. A little spicy, pretty. I think hiccups are gonna come. Then why are you dipping it then? I need flavor, flavor and <laughs> Alright. This is heavy. Alright, let's get a close up. Look at that. Looks pretty yummy. <laughs> Fish with no sauce. Babe, there's a plate next to you. All right, right there's one. It's all minced meat, but very good. It's tasty. It's very soft and wet. I like it when the food is wet. It tastes <laughs> a lot like the masala stuff that we had down below the but it's just whatever now. we had with pa, pa, mm -hmm. that kind of flavor but it's not like super overpowering it's very mild it's good there's more indian tasting burger i don't know if you want like indian masala and that kind of stuff flavors okay it's good i like it but i don't know if you're gonna be like Pooja just wants like a big juicy american style burger yeah just like meat flavor if yeah you don't want all these extra so, let me clean my hands and then Pooja will take her bite. No. She'll, do, she'll do it off camera and then we'll get, okay, we'll get her Okay, thank words. you for being considerate. There we go. Thank you. Okay, and Pooja is taking her bite and? It's good, I like it. But yeah, obviously there's a, uh, there's an Indian taste to it, but it's not that bad. It's like the Like you said, it's not overpowering and yes, it does have that bath bhaji. You got something on your lip there. What's there? Oh, there goes Happy Burger. Uh huh. Oh, see, she had to taste it first before she wanted to take a big old bite on on the camera. Mmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like all of your burger is falling out because it's all minced meat. It's not like a pre-made patty. We're gonna devour this food and then we'll wrap everything up at the very end. Take you maybe walk around again and show you the place. There she is. So we just finished our food and two thumbs up for me. It was really heavy. It was like more than enough for both of us, I think. Eating that by yourself would just be entirely too much. The bun was probably my favorite part. It was a buttery bun, so it was super tasty and soft and nice. You just have to eat it in a hurry, otherwise it'll be falling apart. Soggy and falling apart, so. Now we're upstairs. Wanted to show you this last little bit up here. And yeah. What, what do you think, Pooja? Final impressions of this of this place. Feels like I'm in New York. Very home, very homely style. And this area is more like a workstation though. But they do have uh, nice decorations going on. This mm -hmm. exposed brick walls and the lamps. I don't know, they, the owner said that these were traditional do you know what this said about these? these this type of lattice work is very traditional in, in Rajasthan and it, they use it on like all the furniture you'll see in a lot of traditional restaurants like Indian coffee house has the same thing mm -hmm. and then like even Akuri. their Akuri all of their lampshades and then even like their furniture over here is all on the same side also by the way this is a dumb waiter. They have one kitchen for both restaurants, so they have a dumb waiter that brings the food up and down, which is really cool. I want to put Pooja in there and then send her on down, but she hasn't let me in. So, final impressions. I think this is really cool. I think I like it up here more than Akuri. I think Pooja, what do you think? Which one's better? If you had to pick one or tell people to go to, where would you tell them? Akuri. I like Akuri because uh, very dark aesthetics, very earthy and warm tone and I think I like uh, I like that it they tried to make it into a tradi traditional Bollywood <laughs> cafe restaurant it's really cool. what she's saying is she likes the uh, the Hindi Hindi music no, all, the, all the music that's being played that is not true that's what she really likes uh, down below is more I guess maybe more for like during the day, more for families or something like that. Or even if you want to go work, it's a nice place. Coffee. It's more like a cafe, coffee shop. Up here is more maybe like an evening place or it's for more dinner. Like a fine dining. 
stuff. Like, you know, you get your wine and some pizza. It's a bar. It's more of a bar. It's a place drink. to, a restaurant where you can drink and stuff. Down below is more like cafe, bakery items and stuff like that. So, but I both like both places nice. Two thumbs up for both places. The owner did a great job. Him and his father did an amazing job with both of these restaurants. And I think the one year birthday is coming up for like up August, here. August. In August, the one year birthday for them is coming up. So congratulations to them. We will definitely be coming back. Maybe just have to force Pooja to come upstairs instead of staying downstairs. I like it here. I didn't say I didn't like it. Mm -hmm. Just I like it. Look, more. she even has her New York hat on. She knew she was coming here today. Anything else? Last words? With the bad lighting behind you? Any last words? No. Oh, where are you going? Come visit Jaipur and come to Saparosa and Akuri. Since your friend is coming next week, will you take him here or? I'll bring him to Akuri. Okay. There you go. Yeah. That's it. That's all we got. Thanks. As always, thanks for hanging out with us and looking at this restaurant. Come here. If you are in Jaipur looking for a new cafe, come to Saparosa. Come to Akuri. Later.